so friends welcome back to code tonight so in today's video we will see how to apply slick slider to a responsive device okay so what we are doing is we have one slick slider here and what we will, will do is that it should adjust ac according to the uh, device width and uh, the number of slides should be changing as per the width of the device so here we have these images for sample i have some images and uh, i have initialized the slick slider here before that you have to make sure uh, you have all the scripts uh, here the jquery one the slick min js and the two css files okay so now once you have these in the head section then you can go and initialize the slick slider now for making it responsive what we have to do is we have one property here named responsive and you can pass a array to that property now here we have to mention the breakpoint and this is the width on which this will be applied so if your device width is 1024 then it will show three slides and three slides will scroll okay so now if your device width reduces and comes to 900 then it will show two slides and it will scroll two slides so it works like that that it will change the number of slides as per the device width now we will run the application and we will see how it works okay so you can see by default what we have here is we have four slides to show and four slides to scroll so if you press the arrow keys then it will show four slides okay now what we will do is we will try to reduce the uh, width of the browser and suppose i reduce the width and you can see it is now showing the three slides here okay and it is scrolling the three slides now if i reduce it more you will see it is now showing the two slides okay so this is how it works on responsive and this is how you can modify and configure slick slider to be responsive as per the device width if you want the source code for this then what you can do is you can go to go to night.com and we will also provide you a direct link with the video description and here you have this responsive slick slider blog over here and here you can click on the download attachments and you will be able to download the running source code for this slick slider okay so you can download the source code and you can let us know if you face any kind of issue we will provide you the link with the description so thanks for watching guys and this is how we can apply responsive slick slider in ASP.NET MVC. So thanks for watching.